Hey guys, it's P.M. Mathis, your local independent author. And this is my dedication to Michael Bond, creator of the marmalade loving children's favorite Paddington Bear who has died at 91. And I call this bubble bath. Hi, I'm happily I'll cuddle. I'm six years old. Today I'm going on a field trip. Not sure what I will get into, but I'll find something. I live in the very big forest near Bear Lake. I have two sisters. Seriously, I'll cuddle and surely I'll cuddle. Sirius is always ruining my fun. She does not like to have fun. She likes to hang around to make sure I don't get into trouble. Sure goes with the flow most times, but Sirius always tries to change her mind. And then they both try to keep me in line. Come on, let's get into something. Are you with me? Happy turns to make sure that he's alone. He sets out down the path leading to the forbidding place. Daddy Bear won't let me go, but what he doesn't know won't hurt me. Sirius and Sure are hiding in the bushes, waiting for Happy to make his move. Running, Happy looks around again. Sure, no one is following him. He smiles. Today I will take a field trip to the house of the very close family because I know they are not home. One day when I was passing by, I heard Mr. Very Close say he and the family were going on vacation. That's what I'll do, shaking his head in agreement. Happy turns the corner. Surprise, shouts his sisters. How did you guys know where I was going and how did you sneak up on me without me knowing? Because we're smarter than you, laughs sure. Sirius looks at Happy. I'm going to tell Daddy Bear on you. Unmoved by the threat, Happy walks towards the house. Are you two coming in or are you going to stand out here and imagine the fun I will have with the bubbles? Sure and Sir- Sh- Sirius and Sure stare at one another, trying to figure out what he's talking about. Turning, Happy walks to the side of the house where the window to the bathroom was kept open. Give me a paw, yells Happy. Sure and Sirius went running, not wanting to be seen because they would get into trouble if they were seen and curiosity had gotten the best of them. Push, I'm almost in, Happy says, squirming to get in. Happy gets in, pushes the chair under the window and pulls his sisters in. Okay, says Sirius, where are these bubbles you told us about? Well, says Happy, I saw Miss Very Close come into the bathroom and turn the water on. She put some pink bubbles in the water. Looking around to see if he could find the pink bubbles, I saw bubbles coming out of the water, Happy says, looking through the cabinets. I found it, spinning round, holding up his paw with the bottle. Turn the water on, sure. Sirius grabs the bottle and sniffs. Wow, this smells like flowers. Give that back, Happy says as he snatches the bottle and pours the pink bubbles in the water. Come on, last one in is the rotten bear, sings Happy. Both Happy and Sure jump in. Sirius looks around. What if someone catches us? No one will, Happy says, going under the water. The family has gone on vacation. Peeking out the door, Sirius listens while her brother and sister enjoy themselves. I'm leaving, announces Sirius. Come on, have some fun, Sure says. Bye, Giggles, Happy. See you at home. You won't tell, Sure asks Sirius as she climbs out the window. Sirius leaves without answering. Sure stops, playing. What if she tells? She won't. How do you know, blurts Sure. She will get into trouble too, because she was here too. Happy says, returning to his playing. Happy and Sure were really enjoying themselves when Sure looks up and saw the duck floating by. Where is that duck going? Coming from under the water. What are you talking about? Asked Happy. Uh Uh-oh, we left the water running. Well, guys, again, this has been P.M. Mathis, your local independent author. And this has been a Pew Partner presentation. Please be blessed. (music) Thank <music> you.